What's happening everyone, my name is Annie Up, and this is a loot highlight from running 100 bail runs on Hell Difficulty in Diablo 2 Resurrected. This session was completed playing solo on Battle.net while running 273 Magic Find on my main and 338 on Switch. I'm going to quickly go over the build and then dive into the highlight. This is the setup I ran for the second half of this session. For the first half, I ran the same setup I used in the Chaos Run video. If you're interested in that build, check out the last video, I'll leave the link in the description. That's going to do it for the build. Let's dive in. Give my regards to the abyss. On run number two, Bale drops me a black horn's face and some laying of hands. On run number 3, a horror mage drops me a grand charm. And it ends up rolling offensive ores and 7 faster run walk. A unique tiara drops on run number 18, which is Kira's Guardian. And it rolls 2 off of perfect all resistance. Not too shabby. On run 31, I get a unique Aegis, which is Medusa's Gaze. I get my first Alibaba on run number 49. On run number 51, Bale drops me a unique Kraken shell, which is Leviathan. On run 56, Bill drops me a unique phase blade that has a chance to be either a Naja Wrath or a lightsaber. On run 67, I get my first jaw rune. Knowing the current conditions of the servers, I decided to grab it, save and exit, make sure I had it, and then continue the run. Which, I didn't find anything else for the rest of the run, but I didn't really need anything after that. On run number 70, I get another Leviathan. Nine runs later, I get a unique Monarch, which is my first Storm Shield of D2R. A unique destroyer helm drops on run number 85, which is Demon Horn's Edge. On run number 90, Jamali gives his life for the small charm. And it ends up being my first 20 to life small charm.
Run number 100 brings us the last drop of this session. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button for more Diablo 2 resurrected content in the future. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know in the comment section below. Outside of that, guys, I will catch you in the next video.